In this video I will talk about the line cliché. What is the line cliché and when can we use it? Let's take a look here on the board. We have the C minor chord for two measures. And it sounds like this. Two, three, four. Two, three, four. Which is nice. But sometimes, of course, we want to have maybe a little bit more movement to the music and different colors. Then we can use the line cliché. So here the line cliché will go down chromatically from the root. Down chromatically from the root. So here the chord is C minor. The root of C minor is the note C. Let's go down chromatically from the note C and see what happens. So the C will go down by half step to the note B. The B will go down by half step to the note B flat. And the B flat will go down by half step to the note A. Now, let's see what we have. We have the C minor chord over here, right? We have the C minor over the note B over here. And here we have the C minor over the note B flat. And here we have the C minor chord over the note A. So this will sound like this. So instead of having the same chord for two measures, we have a little bit more movement and different colors. So the line cliché is a single line that moves through a single chord. The single line is this, of course, the B that goes to B flat, an A, that moves through a single chord, C minor, C minor, C minor, C minor. Let's take a look at some examples. If we take the B part of the song, God Bless the Child, we have two measures of the chord C minor, and the melody goes like this. Let's try to use the line cliché and see how it sounds. And then the melody continues. And then again. Right? So, instead of staying over the same chord for two measures, we're doing the line cliché. Let's take a look at My Funny Valentine of Rogers and Hart. There we have four measures of C minor. And the melody goes like this. Now, let's try to hear it with the line cliché. It will sound like this. And the melody continues.
let's try it with the line cliche.